Joaquin du Bellay's Less Regrets and Less Antiquites to Rome stand as poetic reflections, echoing the complex sentiments of a man torn between his beloved homeland and the allure of ancient Rome. Composed during the Renaissance, these works intertwine personal introspection with a profound contemplation of historical and cultural themes. Less Regrets serves as a lamentation, expressing Du Bellay's nostalgia and disillusionment with the political and social landscape of France. He mourns the passing of a golden age, lamenting the decay of a once glorious civilization. Through vivid imagery and melancholic tones, Du Bellay contrasts the splendor of the past with the disillusionment of the present. His longing for a lost era is palpable, evoking a sense of yearning for a time free from the corruption and chaos of contemporary society. In juxtaposition, Les Antiquites de Rome embodies Du Bellay's fascination with the classical world. It serves as a homage to Rome's grandeur, its architecture, and its cultural heritage. Through meticulous descriptions and reverence for ancient artifacts, Du Bellay crafts an ode to the Eternal City, glorifying its history and immortalizing its artistic achievements. His admiration for Rome's greatness is evident, reflecting his desire to connect with a time when beauty and artistry reigned supreme. Both works reveal Du Bellay's dual identity, a man torn between his allegiance to his homeland and his admiration for the grandeur of Rome. His introspective musings in Less Regrets echo the inner conflict of a poet grappling with his sense of belonging. Meanwhile, Less Antiquites to Rome showcases his profound admiration for the classical world, portraying Rome as an embodiment of artistic and cultural excellence. Du Bellay's use of language is noteworthy, his verses are adorned with rich imagery, metaphors, and allegories, painting vivid pictures that immerse the reader in his emotions. His mastery of poetic devices amplifies the emotional depth of his works, evoking empathy and introspection in the reader. Furthermore, the themes of nostalgia, cultural identity, and the passage of time resonate beyond their historical context. Du Bellay's contemplations on the transience of human achievements and the enduring allure of ancient civilizations remain timeless. His exploration of the tension between the past and the present continues to captivate audiences, inviting reflection on the universal human experience. In essence, Du Bellay's Less Regrets and Less Antiquites to Rome stand as testaments to the intricacies of human emotion, the complexities of cultural identity, and the enduring allure of history. Through these works, he invites readers on a journey through his inner conflicts, inviting introspection and contemplation of the timeless themes that continue to echo across generations.